Hi, welcome back! Now I'm going to show you how to choose a violin. If this is the first time you buy a violin, I suggest you to go to a violin store and ask for help. Here is how to choose the violin. First, turn your head to the left and place the violin up on your shoulder. If you can comfortably reach out and wrap your fingers around the scroll, then that would be the right size violin for you. Holding the violin is easy. First, make sure your back is straight and you support your weight on both of your feet. Some people prefer to lean onto the left leg and relax the right. Look over your left shoulder and put the violin up. Bring it as close to your neck as possible and rest your jaw on the chin rest. At this point, make sure two things are happening. Your shoulder stays relaxed, so it's never shrugged, but always relaxed. And your elbow is also relaxed and able to move left and right, so we can reach the notes up here. If you need to change the setup of your shoulder rest, now is a good time to do that. So that's all there is to holding the violin. Let's take a look at how to hold the bow. Okay, let's find out where the fingers sit on the bow. Let's start with the thumb. The thumb is always going to be round and relaxed, just like every other finger. And it sits on its very tip, halfway on the stick and halfway on the frog. The index finger sits at the second knuckle. And if you need to twist your hand towards the bow, that would be great. The middle finger is just going to be round on the bow and the ring finger will touch the dot right there. Now the bow is going to be a little bit slanted this way with the hair closer to you and the pinky is going to be on the second side, the one closer to you. A good way to find out if the fingers are relaxed and in their place is the tap-tap exercise. Let's start with the index finger. Index finger goes tap-tap, middle finger and ring finger together, tap-tap, pinky, tap-tap, and the thumb, tap-tap. Let's do that one more time. Index finger, tap tap, the two fingers together, tap tap, pinky, tap tap, and the thumb, tap tap. Great, now we know how to hold the bow.